Hey, what is going on guys? It is AJ here and I hope you're having a wonderful day so far. Today, we're going to be playing the strong, shirtless, sweaty, stoic man himself, Johnny. It's well known that the reason Johnny sweats so much is because he can run marathons in the game. It's quite admirable, actually. And naturally, we're going to be pushing it one step further by using slow and steady and making the guy sweat even more. Who doesn't want that? For my abilities, I am using quicker recharge, increased clue range, and analyze clues faster. For my perks, I am using Scout for the increased movement speed at the cost of melee damage reduction. Slow and steady so that our sprinting stamina usage is decreased by 50%, but our overall speed is reduced by 10%. And Feral for the flat increase to Savagery. For my grandpa perk, we're using the Grip that suffocates. This perk is absolutely insane on Johnny because he forces victims to close encounter him due to his speed, his tenacity, and his overall ability to chase victims. They basically get forced into a corner and they need to close encounter you. And of course, with this grandpa perk, we're going to be gripping them with a grip that suffocates, but not before huh? oiling them up with our Johnny juices. I swear, would be better, actually. Sliding on down to the attributes, we have 13 into savagery and 14 into endurance. And lastly, here is my skill tree. Just head left, venture upwards, and you'll reach feral. Go to the right and up and you'll reach Scout. And then finally, right at the very top, we have Slow and Steady. Now, Scout is a random perk, so enjoy crying and respecking. <laughs> <laughs> well, that is all from me. Please like and subscribe and I'll catch you guys in the Johnny gameplay. <laughs> Let's go, with Johnny. All those scars on your body. Mm -mm 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 -mm. We're going to absolutely whop some people with shirtless Johnny. I, I, you know what? I, I was reluctant to use Slow and Steady on Johnny. For the simple fact that there's just better perks out there. But I thought I'd do a video on it recently. Um, because it's actually a lot better of a perk than you think. Yes, it reduces your overall movement speed. We only get 5% extra. We're only 5% quicker. But look at how little our stamina drains when we run. Look at this. We barely drain any... We can run around the map like three times with this. I'm not after... I'm sorry, Cook. Oh, no. Okay. I, thought I was rooted in there. Yeah, we can run around the map three, like almost three full times before we run out of stamina. So instead of going like easily tucking out route and swinging like mad, we just sprint it. Just sprint that entire direction. Let's go. <laughs> if you want to be even more saucy, you could also use Blood Runner. Right, let's lock these doors. I'm going to latch those bad boy doors. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Has anyone opened this door down here? They have not. Okay. Should I just go down to the basement? You know what? Screw it. I'm going to go down to the basement. I probably should do this, but. If there's a barricade in the center there, it's going to be so bad for me. There's literally nothing I can do. What is going on here? Come on. Oh, lock the door, please. Oh, there's no back. Wait, Bubba? Oh, Bubba's not even playing. Okay. Well, that makes a lot of sense. All right. Oh, wow. This could be super bad for these guys. Oh, my God. This could be so bad for him. Wait, what's he trying to do here? What's he trying to do? They always go through this gap wrap immediately. Like They're all the same. They all play the same. There's one, another one. Oh, what's going on? Come on, man. Mm, there you go. And dead, baby. <laughs> yeah, the sprinting means you, do, you just don't have to, like, easily tuck it out is going to be better. But with slow and steady, you can swing, like, once or twice, and that's it. Like, yeah, if, if they end up going for a crawl gap, instead of swinging loads, you can just run around it and not really have to worry about stamina consumption. Really good. Let's continue. Oh, up, up the ladder we go, baby. Up the ladder we go. Because, uh... Biggie's disconnected. We're just going to have to sit upstairs. Because otherwise, the cook's going to have a terrible time trying to do anything. I'm going to ignore Leland for now. and just go for the doors. Yeah, see? Don't always tunnel on people, like tunnel vision on people like that. Yeah! We should be able to kill her here, maybe. Yeah, we should be able to kill her here. Oh, she's dead, yeah. Yeah, there she goes. <laughs> there you go, baby. That's all it Let's needs. Let's do this. Mm. Right in the gut. Oh, more than that, huh? No, more no, than no, that? No, 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 no. Business? And there you go. That's two people dunzos. And everyone else has 325 points. There's a Leland and a Sunny. Uh, no, a Leland and a Julie. Julie might have high proficiency. Leland probably does not. Oh, wow. Is that it? Fight me. Fight me, Leland. You're going to have to fight me, buddy. Do you know what's crazy? I know Johnny's hitting pattern, so I know exactly when he will stand still and do a swipe as opposed to do a running swipe. And that's just through like, practice and playing a lot. Oh, there you go. Oh, we made it. Even with slow and steady, we made it down there. And you saw how many times we swung. And then when we sprinted downstairs, even with the reduction in speed, because it's 50% less stamina drain, we was, was able to just run down, run him down like animals. That's crazy. All right, for the last person, we'll, uh, we'll have a little look. 
Oh, wait. Okay, that's the cookie boy. How the hell did they get loose? Uh, oh, Julie. Oh, no, it's not sad. It's Julie. Julie has quite a few points. So let, we need to go and look to see if she's got into an exterior area here. I've not seen Julie all game, to be fair. She could be anywhere. Literally anywhere. Right, so let's activate our ability and try and find her. She might be crouching, though. I think she'll be more than likely crouch, 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 crouching about. <laughs> oh, there you go. I guessed it right. Mm. He's got to run here. Yeah, she's fighting me and suffocating grip wins. GG's, guys. GG's. <laughs> that was crazy. But you see the patrol and potential with Slam and Steady. It's so good. It just means you don't have to worry about... You don't, you don't have to... When you swing a lot, after you finish your flurry... Which you more than likely kill them anyway, but if you don't manage to and they get in they well, you can run down that well and use no stamina and reach them. It's great. GG's. <laughs> Stop it. Enough. It's always with the intros. It's always with the the voice actors really did do a good job. It just goes to show, doesn't it? The voice actors did an amazing job of these characters. What do you guys think? I think the voice actors did an amazing job. And also like the Although the development team is sort of lack on, on, on the bug areas, they do a very, very good job at like designing the characters and what have you. So good. Anyway, let's uh, let's go. Let's play Johnny. We're using slow and steady. We're going to try and get some juicy kills in the basement or just in general. I mean, slow and steady with Johnny. I've just been using it more and more. I do prefer easily tuck it out, but it is super good. It's an amazing perk. Um, it's just a lack of movement speed. Once you're on a victim, though, that movement speed is it doesn't really matter <laughs> because you can you can stick on victims. Um, oh, this, one thing I, I hate about this is that it takes ages for... If the victims don't wake up Grandpa, which is smart, it takes ages to get Grandpa online. And I don't want to take the blood. I'm not using the blood build. See, look, Sissy's getting the blood there. I'll just wait in the basement like a good boy. until we. Hey. Hey, you've undone the door. I want you to open the door. I see you pool of blood down there. Please. If any of those guys chilling in front of the TV could just open this door. Please. Can, can you open the door for me, please? <laughs> I'm in! <laughs> right, okay, I guess... I wonder where the best part... The best point would be to go up. It would, it would definitely be this area. This would be the best part to go up. Oh, here I come, baby. Ready on now. Here I come. Okay, so realistically, there's probably about one, two, three, four doors that are open. There's only five doors in this map. So, that's just judging by the points. I could be completely wrong. Okay, so Garden Shed's open. Garden Shed is open, by the way, guys. Garden Shed. Oh my god, that's a corn dog. Oh, she's hurting bad. She's hurting bad. She probably has a health potion, to be fair. Again, slow and steady. With slow and steady, we can just mosh this. We can keep sprinting for days. Where'd she go? Where'd she go, huh? Oh, she ran through. She ran through. That's smart. I don't think I won't be able to get her here. If she's very intelligent, I will not be able to get her here. Staying in the basement is not a bad thing, necessarily. Go ahead and hide. Yeah, staying in the basement is not necessarily a bad thing because it means Connie's not getting any progress done on doors. And also, I mean, if anyone wells, I can run there because I have slow and steady. She went up this direction, but if she has, she's not going to get anywhere with it. Yep. Now. Yep, she went upstairs. Okay, that's fine. That is cool. It means we're going to come up behind her and cut her off. And she doesn't know if everything else is open either. So this is you should never do this as a victim. If you're being chased and hunted by Johnny, you should never do it. She used her ability on this door, but she hasn't got her ability for anything else. So. That door's closed still. Oh, hey there, Julie. Oh. Bad idea. Suffocating grip. She's lost. <laughs> <laughs> Julie did all this effort, all this work. Just to get suffocating grip. It's so sad, really, isn't it? Yep, and it, that's how, me. I've been running for so long with slow and steady, right? How long have I been running with slow and steady? That is insane. Like, I just, I've non-stop been running. This perk is crazy. I really do appreciate this perk. Oh my god, someone's getting murdered over there. Is that Connie? No, that's... Okay, so Connie could be somewhere around here. I thought that was Connie that I was chasing. I'm going to be honest. Right, well. That settles that, I guess. Oh, I see Connie. I see Connie. There's nothing she can do now. Oh, <laughs> the barrage. She tried going through and that was it. <laughs> oh, you see what I mean, though? How good Slim and Steady is in that basement. I just run around that entire basement. So I didn't even have to stop for stamina. 
It's just you you can just exert so much pressure. It's insane. GG's, GG's. I think mean, that was a four a three K, wasn't it? Nah, it's two K. GG's though. That was good. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Johnny, you got those big old muscles, man. Let's go. We're just part to use. Let's put those muscly boys to use. Look at his slow and steady. We're gonna be using Johnny. We're gonna be using his slow and steady perk. Um, it's not his in particular. You can get it on anyone. But I find it works very well on Johnny because you can basically do laps around the entire place, the entire map, no matter the map, you can do laps. And uh, you would never really run out of stamina. You can swing a, a lot of times anyway, because we have 44 stamina. Look, 44 endurance. We can swing a bunch of times. Why did they just lock on that bit? Did you see that? What? But yeah, and then our stamina, we still have enough to sprint down to the well if they well, for instance, or if we need to get it back in the momentum stride, the stride, or whatever you want to call it. Oh, that is it. I'm going to go down here and murder them. <laughs> hey there, buddies. I'll close the door, though. Oh, this is going to be easy. Oh, please. Oh. Oh, I knew that was going to happen. I'll go, I'll go for Connie here, I think. Oh, she's hurting bad there. She's hurting real bad. Wait, she... Oh, she's going up there. Okay, okay. I see, I see. Hey, corn dog. Oh, wait, that's a terrible decision for her. Bruh. Come on, you got this, James. I'm going to swing with... Oh, no. Yes, there you go, baby. You do have a lot weaker damage. And obviously, you're not going to be as quick. Uh, we have got uh, 50 savagery. However, it is very... Oh, my God. I heard someone well behind me. It is very much the case of you're slower and uh, you have the 10% reduction, which isn't good. Oh, my God. He, he got in cap there, too. That's terrible for him. Wait, 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 wait. He's got a cool gap here, though. <laughs> there you go. I talk about weaker damage. That isn't weak damage. Look at that. Big... Producer. Someone grabbed a bone scrap behind it. So, so I know I know another person's in the basement. Oh my god, Julie's got 725 points. Where are they coming from, Julie? Look at this though. Yeah, we can just sprint so for such a long period of time. Without having to really worry about stam. It's nice. It's it is really refreshing. Oh. I might go upstairs now, maybe? Yeah, I think it's a good idea. Let's go upstairs. Alright, let's close this bad boy door. Bad boy door. Oh, oh, I hear someone. Are they beating down on someone? Oh, no, she's just trying to... Okay. Oh, I hear she's beating down on someone. <gasps> she's at the battery. She's at the battery. Oh, oh she, she, she's taking the ball. I, I won't be able to make it to her. I mean, I have a bunch of stamina. Let's see. Look at this stamina, baby. Look at this stamina. <laughs> Slow and steady for the win. Yes. It means we can get to her and still be able to strike her multiple times. If he in her, we may actually make it. Yeah, okay. I see where she went. I'll find you. Right, there you go. When we track her, it's going to put a lot of pressure on her because she's got the most points. So we'll get her stamina back. There you go. That's enough. That's enough. Did she can do her last a bit of blood. Where are you going, Julie? In here? Hmm? Yeah, she's going to go through the crawl gap there. The thing is, I know where all these cool gaps lead, but I can't actually get, her, get to her, unfortunately. But if I'm tracking her, she's going to have to go upstairs eventually, right? And the moment she does, I'll be able to follow her. I heard someone just take the well, I think. Yeah, the moment she tries to go upstairs, the, the, the moment is the moment I'll be able to kill her here. Ah, no! Okay, I see her. I see her. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pick up her footprints again. And then just continue to do it. This is just pressure. It's like, oh, I see Leland. I see Leland. I've got to go for Leland, actually, because he's unsuspecting. Oh, look at him. The crouchy boy. Julie might think I'm still tracking him. I'm tracking her, but... Oh, come in. Come in, Leland. Oh, that's a terrible mistake from you. Look at him on the floor. Yeah. I won't be able to hit him again there. Nice. That's cool. Any damage is good. Look at how we're able to rotate between all these... Oh, we're able to rotate between all of these little gaps just here. Like, and just run around and not really worry about stamina at all. It's crazy, right? <laughs> I'm going to go track Julie here. Oh, my God, Julie. That's a bad decision from you, buddy. Oh, do you see what I mean, though? Like, she's got a heal again now. We're just keeping these people in the basement repeatedly. It's crazy, right? All right. So, she's going to chase her down. There's nowhere she can go, really. Yep, she's done. She's done here. She's done those. Yeah, there you go. GG's. Look at that. Who's left? Left is Leland. Let's go. Mm. In that punk. Yeah. But you see with slow and steady, it allows you to run around the entire basement. I know you're a bit slower, 
but you can just keep running. You, you like run on stop. You literally just sprint all the time. Right, we'll investigate these footsteps here because these are Leland's. Okay, we'll, we'll have to track. We'll have to track these like almost. I identify where he's gone initially first because these are these are old tracks. I know that. Oh, he went out that way and then. Oh no, he went for the little cool gap. Okay, we need to try and figure out where he went then. He might even be upstairs, but I don't know. Oh, he went down here. Okay, he went round. Good. Obviously, I'll keep an eye out for the well just in case it's upstairs and someone beats down on him or something. But yeah, we'll try and keep an eye out for it. Out. Oh, see, just there. Nice. In through here. Oh, he baffed around. He went back out again, I think. Did he? What the hell is all this? I don't actually know where he went. What is? What even is that? Oh, he must have stopped crouching. I uh, started crouching. Sorry. Okay. We'll go upstairs then and apply some pressure. Hopefully, Hitchhiker's got his traps on the, the battery. Oh no! Please don't be upstairs. Oh, he's not. He's not. Okay. Huh? Oh, sissy, what are you playing at? Sissy, sissy! Ah, she door slammed me. Not a good back. <laughs> hey, sissy, what are you playing at, man? <laughs> Right, let's see, let's see. I hate you, I hate you. Oh, oh, oh. Nah, okay. That's payback. That's, that's payback, baby. How's it feel being on the floor? Yeah, Looking all saucy. <laughs> I'm, done. That's just me. I'm just being petty. I'll tell you what, I'll be, I'll be one petty, you watch. I'm so sorry, sissy. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I don't know if she, whether he's upstairs or not. Oh my god, did I just get some stinky things going on there? I'll tell you what, I'll feed, I'll feed old Grampy up. There you go. I've got 86 blood, so we may have enough just to get him max. Leland's not actually getting any, got any 200 more points, so he's not unlocked anything. Nice, there you go, there you go. Let's see where the man is, the man, the myth. Ah, oh, he's upstairs, okay. That's He was upstairs that entire time. I have a perfect idea, by the way. I'm just going to kick off the generator and run up there. With slow and steady, we can make it. Watch this. He can exit down this way, but I doubt he's going to. They may even stop him before he... Ah, <laughs> he got bad. No. Did he? Was that Hitchhiker? Yeah. I don't think he even got out. That poor, poor man. But if he had off... Look at that. Yeah, he didn't even get out. Poor, poor guy. Oh, that's so sad for him. Nice. GG's, GG's. Oh, Nancy's house again. What? It's just Nancy's house all around. You know what? I respect it. Nancy's only got one period of the day, which is daytime, and it's really ready to get this map, so... Playing this map does not bother me at all. I'm happy to play this map. I barely get to play it. I barely get to see it. It's just family house, gas station, and slaughterhouse all the time. So this is quite refreshing for me. You know what? This game, I'm actually going to play a bit differently. I'm going to collect a bit of blood. Why not? I know you guys are going to grill me, but it's okay. I'd rather not be standing around being useless, you know? So let's go ahead and click some blood. They have a lever, they have a lever boy, and uh, we have a hitchy. So what I'll do is I'll collect blood. I'm, I'm sure hitchy will be collecting blood his side as well, maybe. And that, uh, that way we can get at least two perks online. Or maybe get close to two perks online. That is. Nice. Get the rest of this bad, bad boy blood. Beep. We are using slow and steady, by the way. The build is slow and steady. We're using scout to sort of counteract the, the weak movement speed we have. Oh, go on, Hitchy. Is there one in there? Oh, there is. Nice. He's going for that one. Lovely. All right. I'll go through what I've got to, uh, to Grampy. I don't want to sit on blood because if the animation would take so long, I want to be in the basement as soon as I can. Hopefully, Hitchy will feed Grampy straight after me because he won't scream. And then I can just head down that basement and help Leverboy out. Let's go, let's go. Is he going to feed him? If, if he feeds him, I'll go down. Yeah, he's feeding him. Okay, I'll go down. Nice, 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 nice. Oh, that was a big mistake from you. Oh my god, I, did I hit it like three times there? What is going on? My game's like... Okay, okay, she's run around. Nice. We'll check the... Uh... No, no one's going garden. Oh, we see Danny Dog, we see Danny Dog. Trying to hide from me, Danny? Ah, <laughs> yes! Leatherface hit him like twice, maybe. Three times. That primed him. They cooked him. He undone the packaging for me. And I just finished it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I just finished all of it. All the juice. Give me it. But he also got the screen vibrations for extra effects. Now I gotcha. Yeah, coming downstairs with Leatherface, you put so much... If you know where the doors are, you put so much pressure on victims. Look at this. We'll scan these footsteps, and then we'll follow that guy upstairs, whoever that was. Lovely. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Have they locked this door? We'll always check behind that little uh, toolbox. You don't want to start climbing up and then realize that you see them. 
Right, the footsteps should also be up here. Look at that. Oh, so many footsteps. They always seem to undo this. But it's okay, it's okay. She can do a last, a bit of blood. Oh, hey, Connie. Hey, corn dog. She's undone so much, so many doors. And that is fine. There you are. She's going to go down the well. Nice. One hit. One hit. One hit a Rooney. I slammed the door behind me, so I know if someone opened it, I could hear him open that. All right, the entire upstairs is open, but it's okay. That is all right. That is all right. Oh, my God. Hitchy. Hitchy, boy. Everyone's coming upstairs. Right? Everyone's enjoying their time upstairs. I love it. 425, 200. Always pay attention to the scoreboard. Always pay attention to that. Because it'll indicate whether anyone's popped the lock. They get 200 points. Here you go, old man. Drink up now. God, Johnny's so ripped, right? Shredded boy. Wait, wait, wait. There was blood there. I thought that was an investigation. Yeah, see, um, Lillian's got two more, 200 more points somewhere. Somewhere, somehow. That might have been the basement, but we like to check these doors just in case. Okay, those doors are fine. Hitchy's, Hitchy's just trapped them. The methodical trapping. I like the methodical trapping, baby. Keep that up, man. Oh my god, I see Anna. Oh wow, Anna. That's not a good that's not a good look for you, man. You just slammed the door on yourself, Anna. Oh wow, we're gonna get stamina back here. Oh wait, if Hitchy's if I'm gonna swing and hopefully Hitchhiker will come to me. Hopefully we'll, Hitchy will hear that and he'll come to me. And he'll go into the second room. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. Okay. That sometimes works. That doesn't work all the time, though. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, the generator's been turned off. No. That doesn't always work, obviously. We need to be careful, actually, because if Connie gets to that last door, we're done. We're 100% done. I'll leave that to Hitchhiker. I imagine Hitchhiker's quite close proximity to that. Yeah, he's got... I mean, Leatherface is just camping there. I'll go to the battery. That's more important. Oh, well, I just... I saw you. And I've got slow and steady. Fight me, Leland. Fight me. All Leland's fight. All Leland's fight, and it's over. You're done. So oh my god, Grappler. No. That's all right. That's all right. Connie's had a, a bunch of points. Okay, he might be hinting to distract me. I can't get distracted by him. I need to go check these doors. That one's fine. I know that. Is this. Oh, Corn Dog. You're done. Now that I've seen you, you're toast. Oh, wow. We, we damaged Leland enough for him to get murdered. Mm. Get that punk. And we'll call after Connie. We can't kill her here, just to let you guys know. Oh, Leland isn't killed, actually. He probably has low proficiency. But the reason why I'm climbing after Connie here is because, as Jody, we can do this. We can investigate, and there's no way she can ever escape me. She can go through barricades. I mean, if that barricade was there, that'd still be okay. It'd be fine. But she'll never be able to escape me now. I see her, I see her legs coming up there. Get back here, Connie! Even if she sprints for the upstairs, I'm pretty sure the hitch in Leatherface are upstairs, so there's nothing she can do anyway. Ooh, standing still, I'll be corn dog. Okay. Gonna take the if you take the ladder again, I can still bash it down, buddy. Yeah! And it's only gonna get it's only gonna get worse and worse for her. I'm gonna I'm gonna deactivate my ability for a bit. I'll activate it when I get back down, so it gets a bit of recharge, you know, a bit of scannage. There you go, there's another tracks. Always scan the tracks, let's go. And then we can follow her again. I have I have no doubt Leland has really poor proficiency, proficiency so I, I don't have to worry about that guy at all. Let's just track this girl. Oh, wait. No, oh, never mind. Leland left. He's AFK. Let's go, baby. Corndog's just trying to constantly go up the same area. And I think Leatherface is just sitting at the front garden, which is where she's aiming for. Which is not good. So bad. Oh, that's three kills for old Dragon Fruit. We'll reinvestigate as well. Nice. Lovely. Let's go around. Oh, hey there, corn dog. Oh, she she definitely went all the way through. She went through the garden shed 100%. I hear tippy taps. Oh, did she run back in? Yeah, she ran. She ran back in and round. I think. Yeah, I can I can see her. I can see her. Uh, downstairs. Yo, she's downstairs. She's downstairs. Come to me. Use family focus. Come to me. Hello there. Oh, this, this girl's gonna die. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna stand here. Because <clears throat> I can't get her here, but if I can keep tabs on her, which I'm doing, I'm just gonna wait for people to come down. The, the thing is, she must know that I'm calling out to my teammates. Oh, she's crouching up there, is she? Okay, she's crouching up there, nice. She's through that cool gap. Through that cool gap, Hitchhiker. Through that cool gap. Through that cool gap. And I'll use my ability again, just so I can scan, to see if she's going anywhere, in particular. 
I found our footsteps just here. I found our footsteps. Follow me, follow me. Uh, she went round and up. She went round and up upstairs. Oh, no, no, she didn't. She, she looped back in. She looped back in. Back into this room. Back through the crawl gap. Yep, yeah, back through this crawl gap. <laughs> this is impossible for her to win this. I feel like it's just impossible. Nice. I'll go. Oh, there's no barricade there, right? No barricade. Lovely. Lovely, lovely. She's 100% dead. She, there's a crawl gap there, but I can go around. Yep, there you go. I'll go around. I'll slam that door closed. If Hitchhiker goes that way, I'll loop back around because she's going to go. It's just about like trying to... If you know the maps, you can... Yeah, there you go. One hit. We're just whittling her down. I've got slow and steady. I can run for days, baby. I can run for absolute days. Yeah, go for that. Go for that cool gap. Aim for it. Aim for it. Oh, the bleed out. It's over. It's over, corn dog. Bit of communication. Oh, nice. GG's. Oh, what a kill. <laughs> oh, GG's. Slow and steady, man. Never run out of that stamina.